everybody, Sister Fantastic here, and welcome to the 12 Days of Christmas, Day 2. So today, I've got a bow on the top of my head, and I thought I would, you know, festive things up a little bit. And so I'm so excited. Today, we're going to be doing a mask, a clay mask, a pure clay cleanser from L'Oreal. And I'm just feeling a little bit of a need for a detox, and so I'm just going to get right in with this. And I've got a bowl of water right here, and uh, this mask is gray, so I'm going to use a gray washcloth. I'm just going to moisten my face. And, you know, the thanks, the holidays and Thanksgiving and just all the food, you know, that you might taste that you don't normally eat, you know, can have an effect on your skin. So I'm going to um, purify my skin today with this clay. So I'm going to glow, go right on in with this clay here. And I'm going to pay special attention to the T-zone, which is where I get oil. And, you know, if there's any kind of a breakout or little bumps that appear, it's usually right in these areas. So I'm going to focus there. And this is going to look kind of crazy on me for a little bit till it dries. Anyway, then I'm going to open up days uh, three and four on my advent calendar from Look Fantastic. And we're going to see what we've got in those boxes. And I set it up where you could take a look at it while we're talking. And then I thought it would be fun to show you my Nomad palettes. And um, so since the Berlin Underground palette was featured again and then went, you know, on sale and is now discontinued from their website, you know, a lot of people picked it up this go around and so I've got that one, and then I picked up the Cartagena palette, which I showed y'all, and, but we didn't ever do any swatches out of it, and then recently, for Black Friday, I placed an order with them and received um, the Iceland Fire and Ice palette at half off. So that came in, and I just thought we would just do some swatches and stuff today. Just do a little swatch party. Let's have a party. Let's have a Christmas swatch party. And talk about eyeshadow. So, that's going to dry. It's not going to take long. Um, it's a mousse-like texture, and it's really, really uh, gentle on the skin. And so it doesn't take long. And you don't even really have to let it dry if you don't want to. You know, if you're of a mind just to use it as a cleanser, you can. So, but it removes impurities and there's three different kinds of clay plus charcoal in it. So it's really, really good for uh, combination to oily skin, which is what I have. I have combination skin. So, but before we get into the swatch party I wanted to and the look fantastic I wanted to share a couple of Christmas cards that I got we got one from my husband's company where he works TKC Holdings and they sent a package in the mail and of course anything that comes in the form of a box he just assumes that it's gonna be you know mine and so he didn't even look at the label and he just brought it straight to me and I opened it up and I pulled this card out and I realized this is from his um, his company, so I let him finish opening it, and it was a uh, a tumbler cup that has a thermal uh, insulated, and then there's a, a cap on it where you could use it for hot or cold drinks, and it's really nice. It's solid black, and I shouldn't have, I should have brought it over here, but I didn't. But anyway, it says we're so thankful this holiday season for our team members, family, and friends. We would like to express our sincere gratitude for the tremendous efforts exemplified by our dedicated team here at TKC. We wish you all a joyful holiday season and a happy, healthy new year. 
warmest regards and then he signs the CEO signs his name so anyway um, he did get a cup and also they have new winter coats that have been ordered so that's gonna be nice insulated jackets and you know with the company logo so that's really cool plus he has some reward points where he's earned some like bonus rewards throughout the course of the year and he can spend those you know on whatever he wants so we're supposed to get on online to their site and choose things out and so anyway he's going to have a real nice christmas from his company i'm just really proud of him all right and then i got a christmas card from kimmy's boxes and so anyway this is how it comes cute little stickers and kimmy lives all the way in south milwaukee wisconsin so the card looks like this matches my decor doesn't it it says season's greetings on the front and inside it says lori warmest thoughts and best wishes for a wonderful holiday merry christmas love kim and then she drew a christmas tree huh, right there isn't that cute complete with candy canes and a star and everything adorable Kim, I just love your artistry. Thank you so much for thinking of me. And for those of you that do want to do a Christmas card exchange with me, um, if you want to do like Kimmy did and just send me a card, um, you can. Um, just, you know, all you have to do is ask me for my address over in a private message on Instagram. Or you could just drop me your address in the private message and... You know I'll give you mine back and we'll exchange Christmas cards so that's I'll be sending those off pretty soon and as they come in you know uh, addresses and everything come in that I will um, reciprocate all right so let's look at uh, bef before we look at the palettes let's look at what's in the drawers for th day three and day four for look fantastic advent calendar box so, day three is this one. I don't know if y'all can see where I'm pointing to. Right here in the lower corner. And it was kind of a deep, shallow box. Anyway, it's the Ilamasca Hydra Setting Spray. So, very nice. I've never, I've tried Ilamasca products, but I've never tried their setting spray. This is perfect for travel. And I need a setting spray for travel, so that's awesome. That's definitely a keeper. And then for day four, it's that box right there. And this is the Caudalie Paris Vino Source Hydra Cream SOS Hydration Intense Moisturizing Cream. So a nice little moisturizer from Caudalie. And that will come in handy as well. All right, let me, this is not quite dry yet, so before, before I get into the swatches, let me show you what's going to be in the giveaway for today. I, uh, BoxyCharm has their two for, you know, two for deals, and so I picked up two of these um, lipsticks here. They're, it's like a lip balm, really, but this from MAC. And it's in their sheer formula so it's not as dark as what you think it might be so anyway I picked up two of those and here is mine so let me just swatch it for you and I may apply it on my lips once I remove this mask so but anyway here's what the bullet looks like so this is what you'd be getting just a beautiful it's a Christmas red but it's very sheer and you can sheer it out even more you can wear it as a lip balm and it's got kind of a sheen to it and it feels very moisturizing and emollient on the lips and if you wanted to you know you can build it up but the pigment is still pretty sheer it's not gonna be super super dark at all and I tried this on yesterday and I love it so let me just set that to the side and we will come back to that in a few minutes so for right now I want to 
stay tuned, stay tuned. I'll give you a secret word, but let me get this mask off and then we're gonna have a swatch party. I wanna get this. One thing about purifying masks is that if, uh, and this will suds up like a foaming cleanser, you know, when you go to wash it off. So it's really like a dual purpose type mask. But if you're not careful, the charcoal masks on, if you have combination skin, you know, like me, the outside perimeter of my face is going to um, get kind of dry feeling if you're, if you leave it on too long. So I'm going to go ahead and get this off. My little thing is just a bobbing. But L'Oreal has good products, uh, good skincare products, good um, clay masks, pore cleansing masks. There's um, another one that's out there. It's not a foaming cleanser. It's um, it's just a mask that is clay, just straight clay, and it dries down just like a regular clay mask would. And I can hear the foam and the suds on this still. So I'm gonna make sure and rinse it off good. I should have used my glove, my little washcloth from glove. Okay, that's pretty good. Let me flip it over and just... And I'll put a moisturizer on in a, in a little bit. I feel like I've got this really floofy, it's a bow is what it is, but anyway, I put it on this hat because I thought that would be fun. Okay, let me show you these palettes. Um, let's start with the Berlin Undergrad. This is the oldest one that I have. This is the first one that I received. And of course, many of you already know what it looks like. It's got just these beautiful grungy colors, but there is a red and there is a green and there are golds. And then this gray one right here is almost like a silver. So you could definitely do a Christmas look with it. So let me just swatch two or three of these and show you what I'm talking about. We'll do the gold, the green, that grayish silver, and then this, it's like a burnt orangey red. And, ooh. All right, so I'm gonna go down the side of my arm here. There's the gold, there's the green, there's the silver. It's kind of a taupey type silver. And then there's that burnt orangey red. So they're so pigmented. But you, 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 that would make an awesome Christmas look right there. So I wanted to show that to you. And many of you are already familiar with the grays and the blacks and, you know, just the grunginess of the palette, the golds and everything. But we're looking for ideas, you know, for Christmas, inspiration. And it's nice to have something already in your collection that you can use. You know, and many of you have this palette. Okay, so let me just wipe these swatches off. And I'm about to lose this, y'all. I feel it coming off. I may have to take it off. I think I may have to take it off. I'll leave the hat on. I have to do a better job at taping that on. I just had it secured with one piece of tape. Okay. 
So here's the, the Cartagena palette. Beautiful. And there's a gorgeous red in here. And the greens are like yellowish greens, which that's not totally off base. You know, whenever you do a Christmas look, you know, you want to um, sometimes get creative. I mean, when you think about the Grinch, you know, you think about that that greenish yellow yellow there. So anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna swatch it. And I'm gonna swatch the one right next to it, which is like a greenish gold. And then there's um, like a like a like a, a lighter matte right next to it in the corner. So those first three right there, I'm gonna swatch those for you. So there's that greenish gold. Here's that shimmer. And this is the one that was in the upper left hand corner. So there's some greens. They're light yellowish greens, but they're greens. Okay, and then let me just wipe my fingers off. I'm going to go on with these reds and show you these reds. Because we all need red in our life this time of year. Okay, let me do. Let me do definitely do this one, and I'm going to do this one, and then I'm going to hit that pop of glitter right there. Okay, so this is the orangey, more like an orangey red that was in the middle. And here's that red red that was on the outer edge and it has like an orange tint to it which is absolutely beautiful and here's that glitter which is just a stunning gold and I really need more light on this but anyway you can see it as it shifts so it would really really show up this is beautiful y'all right here that one absolutely beautiful so anyway there's just some all you know alternate type greens and reds in that palette i thought that was fun so you know we're all looking for you know sometimes you just want a little bit of a difference you know in a shade Instead of the Kelly green and the candy cane red, you know, you might want just something that will go good with your complexion, you know, or just with the idea that you have. So, let me set that right there. And I'm trying to keep up with everything. Okay, and then my package came. From Nomad, they put the sticker on it, and that happened in the mail. I do not know what is going on with these packages, but I read on the FedEx site where there was over 400 packages that they found in a ravine just dumped there. And so, anyway, they're looking into all that, but there was a public statement from FedEx, um, you know, claiming that they're doing, you know, they're taking responsibility and they're, you know, there's an investigation and they're sending the packages out, you know, even after they've been there and, you know, it was just wild. Okay, so they sent me some cards. One of them was a happy holiday card from, it was personalized from them. Isn't that wild, y'all, right there? So that's the Iceland Fire and Ice inspiration. And so they hand wrote, you know, my name, Savannah, Tennessee, and they signed it personally from Felicia and Auntie. So that was cool. So the second card here, um, you know, looks like this, but it's got their picture on the back. So the personalized touch, so I thought that was really cool. So they wrap it like this 
And I'm really excited for this palette because this winter, I'm just thinking about blues, icy blues, uh, some pretty shades of purple. Um, you know, just finding inspiration in those color stories. And so here she is. I'm so excited about this palette. I couldn't believe I got it for half off. And the Cartagena was only $17.99 on Ipsy. So that was amazing. Okay, that's the packaging. Let me set this color saver aside. And here's all the pretty shades. Oh my gosh. The blues and the greens, the turquoise shades. So let me do the reds and greens in this palette. So we're going to start with the reds. There's a couple of beautiful reds. So this one and this one. I forgot to clean my arm. Let me do that real quick. We'll get all these other shades off. There's some pigment in these. I mean, they're beautiful pressed pigments. That Cartagena palette, those, those mattes especially. Okay, I'm gonna get this off. Okay, here's the first red. Look at that, y'all. Woo, there's so much pigment. And here's that second red. It has like a shimmer. My arm is kind of wet, so that's going to really pick up. That is amazing. Okay, let me wipe my fingers off, and then we'll, I want to hit that green, a couple of these greens. i got to make sure this red's off my fingers, though. That is very pigmented. Very pigmented. Okay, let's see. For the greens, let me... Let's see. I definitely want to hit that one. And... This is a green right here. That's pretty. So those two. And then... Hmm... Let's do those two. And let's do this one right here. Okay. So let's just go in a row right here. Let's do Elves. And Gallows Lava. And Northern Lights. Oh, this is beautiful. Holy moly. Somebody needs to stop me. And let me just hit this grayish one up here. It's called Odin. Just for, just for fun. All right, here we go. Oh, look at that. And that's like a grayish green with the pinky. That's not a very good swatch. Look at that one right there, y'all. That is so pretty. Okay, so I went I went in a row. Let me show you the the order I did them. So I did this one right there. That's that first one. See how shiny that comes out? It's like a, there's a grayish tint to it. And there's that green that's got kind of an olive hint. Second, really deep evergreen. And then that one right there, which I think I went over that with the wrong finger. So let me, let me hit it again. I want to make sure that you guys see that. Look at that. That is stunning. Northern Lights is the name of it. 
and then that last one down there on the bottom of my arm is this grayish green called Odin which is a matte so let me let me build that one up so you can see it better look at that that would go good with the blues or the greens it's really pretty it's like a muted turquoise with you know it's got the gray in it but it's got turquoise which is like blue and green beautiful 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 so there you go there's reds and greens in that palette so you see all three of these palettes have reds and greens of you know different shades different tones and uh, they could mix and match I mean if you laid all these palettes out and you know you just played in the reds and greens just to create some you know really beautiful Christmas looks amazing amazing so there you go that's the Iceland fire and ice palette so there's more blues and greens in it than there are reds but look how look at that I'm wiping it away y'all and it's that top one there Ooh, it was so pigmented we've got some pressed pigments for sure in this palette I'm gonna have to wash my arm off with soap <laughs> okay all right let's finish this giveaway and so for today um, let's use the word fire for this lipstick and let me put this on and y'all can see what it looks like so you see it's not really super dark you know that's just one simple pass you could use this with a lip liner or just use it as a lip balm or just put it on you know so you can build it up but it's really creamy hydrating beautiful beautiful shade beautiful formula it's called sea sheer so anyway if you're interested in this giveaway use the word fire down in the comments in a sentence uh, this is for the u.s only um, usual rules apply i'm not going to go into all of it y'all know the drill subscriptions public 18 or over blah 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 so that is it for my video today you guys need to get this cleanser it is really a nice one it foams up plus it's got that clay and it'll mop up the oil and keep your skin from drying out because it is moisturizing so very nice very nice three three clays and charcoal detox and brighten clay to mousse so it starts out with clay and then it's got like that moussey formula that foams up very nice very nice mask okay that is it for my content today um hope you all enjoyed it just leave me a comment down below let me know what you think about these palettes and if you have any of them and look stay tuned for day three look fantastic we are going to be opening up boxes five and six so this is going to move all the way through the month of December. Appreciate you guys watching. God bless you today. It's my prayer. I'll see you next time. Bye.